All right, guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how to add a tagline to your website. A tagline, what is a tagline? A tagline is a small word that represents your your brand, represents the product of, of your brand. Let's let's take Nike, for example. When you hear about, when you hear of Nike, remember the slog called Just Do It. Another one is, is the Toyota. The Toyota, when you hear about Toyota, you, you remember their slog saying, going places another one is the walmart walmart sl slug says save money live better so let me show you let me quickly show you how you can add slug to your website so you want to add we want to add a slug to this website as you can see we just build this website so it looks shabby it's not professional so let's make it a little bit professional so you want to get started before you get started let's first go to the customize area you can go from here there are two ways that you can do this you can go from here customize or you go right from the dashboard let's go from the dashboard then so you want to go to appearance then go to customize so you want to go to site identity and site title let's first let's add title you want to add title to your, to your website so I want to use the name of our website. Let's see, fitness. And learn. So, this is our website title. So now you want to add tag tagline to this as a slug. Okay, this tagline is a slug. It is different from your post tag. Okay, don't be confused with it. Uh, post tag or pages tag. You want to add tag or tags for your for your post or pages are different from tagline. Tagline is a slug that says something about your website or the product of your brand. So now let's add tag. Yeah, so just you can generate you can quickly generate tag. If you don't know which tag you can you can use, you can quickly generate you can go to tag generator if you want to generate a tag. So let's say I want to generate I don't know tag. That I can generate to this for this title here for this website. So you can go to tag generator. This this website I can generate tag for you. So let's go here and generate tag. You want to add the name of your website here yeah? and uh, search. Let me generate the tag here. Yeah. So as you can see, yeah, people like fitness only. You're never alone with a fitness salon. So I do sleep with fitness salon. What is fitness salon? All you are is fitness salon, just for the test of fitness. So let me let's use this this one right here. So let's copy this. So I'm just gonna modify it myself here. So let's go to the website here. So. Just for the taste of fitness. So there is my my slug. I don't need to post fitness on Just for the for the taste of fitness. So this is great for my for my fitness website. I can also if I don't like this, I can also, I can also simply simply write fitness fitness guide and tips this is great for your great for fitness and fit, for a fitness website this kind of slug is go along very well with it so look cool right now so let's say I want to see how it look like now so let's publish it So now it's, it is sitting, as you can see right here, you cannot see this, the tagline, you can only see the, the title, this is the title of the website. So let, let make it visible, let's make the tagline visible. So you want to unhide it here, you want to untick this place here. Now let's see, now as you can see, the tagline 
Now it's very visible. Everybody can see the tagline. Let's say I want to add it again. I can just add this. Let's say I want to add the title also. I can add the title also, yeah. And that is it. I've added the title. So let me make it visible. Back again. And that is it. It is visible. So let's say I want to add logo here. Yeah. I've already make a logo. And if you guys want to know how to how to make a free logo on Canva, I made a video. Watch my video down below. Watch, check the link down below. So you, you see how I make this logo here. Yeah. So let's use this logo here. Yeah. You can just scrub the cropping. So I, I don't want to crop the. So let's skip cropping. And that is it. The logo is now there. And it look great. Okay, you can adjust just like that. And publish. When you finish, you hit publish. So now let's look. Let's see how it look like right now. Let's go ahead and visit our website here. Yeah. And the website look professional now. So it look pretty professional. So let me let me quickly show you the second the second step the second method to change your your tagline. So add a tagline to your website, tagline and title to your website. So let's go back to dashboard again. Okay. I can go to settings. When you over over to check settings, then you go to general. So you want to go here, site title. As you can see here, you can change the site title, you can add your site title here, tagline, you can add the new tag list. So I want to add the new tagline. Yeah. I want to change the tagline and add that. You can also change your your email address here. Yeah? If you want to change your email address, you can change it here. Yeah? You can change the membership here. Yeah? If you want if you want to add this here. Yeah? You can change the, lang the language of your website here. Yeah? Yeah. You can change the time zone here. Yeah? You can change the date format here. Yeah? You can get you can change time format here. Yeah? And you can change the week start start on. And decide whether you want the, the week to start on of on Sunday, Friday, Saturday, or something like that. Or, so when you finish, you hit save, save change. Now it is done. So let's check it out back again. So now the website looks great and professional. So that's how you, how you change your, how you add tagline to your website. Well, oh, guys, subscribe to this channel. Leave your comment down below. I'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.